two, match one. Two, three shots in the air for 1501. Thrust, four, five shots. A late volley from Super Duper. Going into teleoperated period, Blue Alliance up 37 to 27, but this could be anybody's game. Seeing heavy defense in the Red Alliance, score, Red Alliance scoring zone. Super Duper with a volley, thrust right behind them. Thundercats looking to cause some chaos. Kilobytes looking to clear out the few power cells left in the rendezvous point. Conductors cleaning up the extra balls being scored on the Red Alliance. Speaking of the Red Alliance, pulling ahead 57 to 46 with 85 seconds left to go in the match. All six robots on the Red Alliance side. Looks like Kilobytes making a score from the trench. Well, 1501 is taking advantage of zero defense and getting in a few more balls of their own. But the lead is shrinking. One minute left to go in the match. Huskies on hogs, cleaning out. Balls that are being fed back into the field. You can only have 15 stored in the driver's station. Red Alliance pulling ahead, 40 seconds to go, up by 20 points. And extending the lead just a little bit more, thanks to Super Duper and 1501. 90 to 52. Here's that sound. Blue Alliance lined up for the triple climb. Thundercats have their grappling hook in the air. Thrust lined up. Blue Alliance climbing. Will they all be in the air? 10 seconds to go. We might have a double triple here. Super duper in the air. Can 1501 get there? That's the match. Final score on the board is 125 to 52, but with the match under review, we'll just have to wait and see the final score. We'll be back in a minute. What a crazy ending to that match. Let's get a look at the scores. The Red Alliance takes the win. 180 to 142. Red Alliance putting a win away. Blue Alliance will have to fight for their life in the next round. We're gonna throw it back to Dave and Carl and the top of the alliance bracket. We'll see you in semifinal two of three, of four.